G'day folks, I just thought I'd make this little quick video for all those folks out there who um, have this same problem that I have, but I just bought this brand new uh, E-Flight Trojan T-28, which is a magnificent airplane. Um, all set up, it was bind and fly, all ready to go, rock and roll, and I just noticed that, um, well I didn't notice, I knew that it had this IC3 battery connector um, for the Spectrum smart batteries. The problem with that is all of my batteries are XT60 and XT60 and IC3 does not fit. So anyway, this is a little quick tip for you just to let you know what I did to fix it. As I got a, um, so this, the battery is an XT60 female, right? And then the, the bit that goes on the plane is an XT60 male. Um, obviously I could just snip the wires or whatever, but I didn't want to do that just in case I wanted to sell the plane to someone who actually has Spectrum smart batteries. So I made a little adapter, connector. Um, so what I did is I took an XT60 female, that one, and I actually got my Dremel out and I just cut all the plastic off the connectors. There we go, put it in focus, connectors. And just so happens that these little brass connectors there and those these females and these males here are exactly the same size so all I can do is this and I'll put it in and it goes in beautifully nice and tight nice and tight um, all tested and everything so that's it so that's a little quick tip just another little um, extra bonus for those who've got these right um, normally you put the battery in there and that means you've got to feed your battery connector and all your cables and everything in here first to plug it all up that's a bit of a pain in the butt. So anyway, I made a little trench here along there, and this is going to sit there like that, all down in its right spot. And I'll, I'll just get it in there because this, when you put the canopy on it, it sits flush on this plate here. And then I can just chuck my batteries in this way. Well, actually, it's a three cell, so it goes like that. And then I can just plug it in this way. So anyway, that's my little quick tip for today. I shall stop recording. Bye.